So now what we're going to show you guys is how to place bite wings on Dexter, but also set it up on the computer. We're going to show you horizontal bite wings. So just like you've seen before, when you're in Dexus, you're going to go to what looks like a little pinwheel. We're going to click it. And down here, we're going to click bite wings. Once this is lit up green and says it's ready to go, that means you're good. So I'm going to come over here. So in lab, even though Dexter's not a real person, we always want to make sure he has a lead apron on. Okay. So what I'm going to place first is I'm going to show you the placement for Dexter's right molar shot. We're always going to work on the right side of our patient. You might be in an office where you physically cannot get on the left side. So we're always to stay on the right side of our patients during exposure. This silver handle is how we close Dexter's mouth and open Dexter's mouth. Be careful, he's a little fragile. There we go. You wanna make sure that the maxilla is parallel to the floor. Okay, that's gonna help with our angulation. So for our first shot, we're gonna do our molar shot. You wanna make sure that you follow the central ray and key into proximal space. So our central ray for our molar shot is right in the mandibular molar, right down in the middle. And our key into proximal space is between our first molar and our second molar. So once I have everything lined up, I'm gonna slowly have Dexter close down. Always make sure your PID is close by to you. And then our angulation is gonna be a positive 10 degrees. So if you look in the back, you can see our angulation. Remember, Positive angulation is downward. So we're gonna line up positive 10 degrees. And that's gonna be our molar shot. When we're talking about our right premolar shot, you have to keep the rhomboidal curve into consideration. And what'll happen is instead of our sensor staying super parallel to the teeth, they're actually gonna angle forward. So when this angles, your central ray is going to be the mandibular second premolar and in between the first molar and the second premolar on the maxilla. Now I'm gonna slowly have Dexter close down again. Get my positive 10 degrees and line him up. This is gonna be the same thing on the left side. However, like I said, you still have to remain standing on the right side of your patient. 